Hello everybody, this is Goomba, welcome back to more Let's Play Sly Cooper and the Thievius Raccoonus. Now we are actually going to start the first mission, so let's get this thing underway. The road trip gave me the time I needed to study up on Sir Raleigh the Frog. As a young man, this hot-tempered frog grew bored of his life of luxury and privilege. On a whim, he tried his hand at a bit of piracy and found it to his liking. Raleigh, who quickly became addicted to crime, was brought into the Fiendish Five as chief machinist, where his evil tinkering genius rose to new heights. The last reported sighting of this mad machinist was off the soggy coast of the Isle of Wrath, a small island uncomfortably situated in the middle of the perilous Welsh Triangle. <laughs> Alright. So, yeah, this is uh, the first episode of uh, not only this uh, Let's Play, not counting the, introdu the introduction as one, but hey, what can you do? Okay. Okay, I didn't really explain the controls about the attacking that well last time, so yeah, I'm gonna explain it now. To attack, just simply push the square button. No problem. I'll just use my climb move. Okay, but remember, you can only climb on certain objects, like pipes and ropes. Yeah, sure, and like that ladder there? That is correct, but do not forget, Sly. You have to get close. Then hit the circle button to grab it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Relax, Bentley. I live for this stuff. Yeah, and that's what worries me. <laughs> uh, I always love the humor in this game. Uh, other Sly Cooper games. Okay, these bowels are clues. So yeah, there's a safe in uh, every episode, somewhat. Well, every world. The uh, you know this hub. You know, this episode-like place, I don't know, I don't care, whatever. We have, uh, 30 bottles to find in every area, stuff like that. Hold on, Sly. See those searchlights? One careless step, and you'll be subjected to acute combustion. You done whining? Let's go. I'm just trying to keep you alive, partner. Fortunately for you, I launched these signal repeaters throughout Raleigh's fortress. Get close to one, and I can checkpoint your progress. Nice. Huh. So yeah, those uh, green areas over there, they are actually checkpoints. And what I'm doing now with the binoculars, I, you know, just activate and deactivate them with the R1 button. Can I hit these? No, I can't. Okay. Okay, don't get caught with the searchlights, and you'll be fine. There we go! Whoa. Ah, damn it. <sighs> See that? I just died there, so, yeah. If you get hit, you die, and if you die, you lose a life. I've forgotten how to uh, collect lives within this game, you know, because after all, I haven't played this in years. Oh, uh, yeah. <sighs> trying to figure out how to skip this. I mean, I accidentally reactivated it, so... Yeah, sorry about that. Don't worry, it won't happen again unless I do it again by accident, which isn't likely. Yeah, sure, and like that ladder there? Okay, alright, it was the L1 button again. <laughs> I'm an idiot! <laughs> idiot C! Uh... Duh. Just grab onto the ladder by pushing the circle button, uh, stuff like that. You have to be pretty damn close, though. FYI. There we go. Ah, 
Oh snap. Bitch. <laughs> Yay. Okay, checkpoint activated. If you happen to activate a checkpoint throughout a level, and it, then you get killed... Blimp looks more like a machine than a hideout. You're right, Sly. That is a storm machine. It's the reason why it never stops raining around here. That explains all the wrecked ships. But why would Raleigh want bad weather at his own hideout 24-7? Beats me. But rain or shine, I'm gonna steal my family's book back. And if Raleigh gets in my way, it's on. <laughs> As I was saying... Hey, Troop, I kind of lost track of what I was saying. Oh yeah, now I remember. If you happen to activate the checkpoint and if you get killed, you'll return to the previous checkpoint you activated. However, if you happen to lose all your lives, then uh, you have to start the level all over again. <sighs> okay, I was wrong about the number of clues. There's actually 20, not 30. I'm not thinking. Maybe it's a different number for different levels, although I don't exactly remember for sure. Oh, another thing you should know in this game. Sly Cooper cannot swim, <laughs> much like Sonic the Hedgehog. Nice job so far, Sly. To get over the next gate, you'll need to grab onto this hook using your cane. Just jump and hit the circle button. Got it. Jump and hit the circle button to grab onto hooks. <sighs> wow, well, about, about seven minutes. I'm gonna record until I get to the, you know, the next hub. As you know, uh, I don't know. What am I saying? For every world or episode, there's a hub. You know, there's always a hub for every chapter or whatever. I don't know if it's called chapters, episodes. I really don't know, and I really don't care. Okay, here we just have some more platforming. Uh, trying to concentrate, keep my eyes open. And here we go. Nice, another checkpoint. Uh, more spotlight action. Okay, okay, made it for the first. Whoa, watch out for that guy. Okay. Okay. Took out the siren. And, by the way, if you take out the sirens, you know, you'll knock out the searchlights. Very strange, I know, but hey, it's a video game, you're not supposed to argue with video game logic. <laughs> that was weird. <sighs> God, how do I get up there? Oh, yeah. Now I remember. Huh. Alright, we got a key! <laughs> excellent. By the way, we can't traverse on this rope yet. We have to... Oh wait, never mind, I'm an idiot. I'm thinking of something else. <laughs> I'm so stupid, I swear. Okay, no I'm not, but still. Uh, I'm just not thinking. I haven't played the game in years, so age, you know, and time, you know, they really haven't been kind to me. Let's jump down. Oops, wrong button. Die, idiot, again. Okay. Yeah, that was the safe over there. And here is the key. You know, where the key goes. Idiot. Ugh. Well... I'm going on. Wow, only 9 minutes and uh, 43 seconds. Okay, we're here at the first hub, so hurry for that. Double jump up here. And here we are. Welcome to the first hub. It looks like the most secured location on this boat. If Raleigh's really as smart as his police files suggest, 
and that's where I'll find him. Wonderful idea, but your plan is flawed. Why? Because it's impossible to get near him. To access Raleigh's blimp, you would have to sneak through that high voltage power tube. To do that without getting electrocuted, you'd have to destroy that power generator. And to do that, you'd need two more of Raleigh's treasure keys, which are heavily guarded. Interesting. So when are you gonna get to the impossible part? Fine! But I warned you, I marked the areas you need to hit with holographic markers. Follow them to your objectives. Thanks. Don't mention it. It's your funeral. <laughs> Well, that, well, we pretty much know where to go to now, so I'm ending the video here because I have like uh, about 10 seconds left on the clock. This is Goomba, I will see you all next time for when we do the first hub, I mean the first world of this hub. Okay, bye!